in a landmark event. INEOS has announced its donation of £25.3 million to the Defence Medical Rehabilitation Centre at Stanford Hall in Nottinghamshire. On the 28th of May 2019, Sir Jim Ratcliffe paid a visit to the centre to meet members of the board. If you come here you're with a trauma, your head's not in a very good place. This is quite uplifting, really, for somebody who's in a very difficult place when he arrives. Thanks to INEOS's generosity, a new state-of-the-art prosthetics wing has been built to aid the recovery of patients like Corporal Andy Reid. Went on a routine for patrol. Unfortunately, stepped on a pressure plate. I was laying on the floor, on my back. I looked down, couldn't see my legs. Straight away, I thought, I'm surviving not a victim. This has been purpose-built to get those guys out of the wheelchair, get some prosthetic legs on, get them in the bars, get them walking, and then, as we said before, go around the test track and test those limbs and test the walking ability in a safe environment or an environment that, that's real to the real world. Building on the incredible work of the Grosvenor family, INEOS's donation will mean that wounded service men and women will get the best support possible. Well, the DNRC means a huge amount to me because obviously my father sadly passed away two years ago, so this is a project that, that he came up with when he was back in the military, he served for 40 years. I took it over when he, when he sadly passed away. It's the whole facility that's you know, really very impressive when you drive in. It's been so well done. I will be very pleased they called it uh, the Ineos Wing. It's a good cause.